All right, we are back. Okay, so let's try to do these two side missions, and then we finally go back to Nivelheim. Ugh, oh, man. It's never easy, huh? Never easy. All right. Oh. The doggy? What a sweet boy you were, staying behind for me. You'll be good to Torgan now, you hear? Did you just pay that dog money? Oh, him? That's Melon, Torgan's pup. He comes by from time to time to sell their farm's produce. We grow our own veggies here in town too, but the ones from Torgan's fields are especially delicious. Come on, let's go after him. All right. Got my drink ready. Let's go. Wait, for real? Ah. Sorry. Huh. Yeah. Sorry about the echo. I was uh looking at the stream uh, through my iPad. I'm not sure if you guys heard that. I lowered it. Unable, huh? Unable. Are you Torgan? There's my boy. How'd it go today? Good? Hello. Not seen you before. Out of towners? Just visiting, yeah. So, could we buy some of your produce? Can't help you. Don't sell to out of towners. Barely got enough for the locals as is. Judging by them duds you got on, you're city folk, ain't you? I ain't about to sell the bounty of my soil to youngins who ain't never got down in the muck with me and mine. Now get. I don't know the first thing about farming, but I do know how happy these veggies are. Can practically hear them. <laughs> got an eye for the stuff, but you're telling me you got an ear too? What's this one saying? Something about how rich the soil is, how it can thrive and spread its roots deep, grow big and strong. I'll be. Oh, quit with the guilt tripping now, will ya? You know perfectly well I wasn't gonna leave them high and dry. Huh. We ain't seeing any more customers today, I reckon. So whatever we got left over is yours for the taking. Thank you so much. We really appreciate it. They finally learned to talk back? <laughs> We're actually trying to make Gungaga mushroom soup. What do you think we should use? Any advice would be great. Hmm. At the risk of stating the obvious, you'll need some quality Gungaga mushrooms. Or better yet, some Maganga mushrooms. They'll take that soup of yours to the next level. Things grow on a hill near here, but unless you got one hell of an eye, better to rely on a chocobo. They're flavorful suckers, so three caps ought to more than suffice. Pick them one at a time, though, if you want to keep your bird from getting all addled. Their aroma can be mighty powerful. And be mindful of the beasties, too. A lot of types are awful fond of the mushroom scent. Gotcha. Ah, and you can't forget the salt. Nothing brings out the flavor better than a sprinkling. And Magunga mushrooms being what they are, you're going to want to savor it. Proper kind of salt for it's got a color close to this. Melon, 
You get them where they need to go. So, does the dog know exactly where they... Okay. I'll choke about. Right? Yes. Oh, it's right here. Oh. All right. Over here? Oh no. Really? Kinda in a rush, so get him. Morgan Main, huh? Deal with that. Fire. Everyone's fire. Get ready. Okay. Here, uh. What the? Oh, come on. Finish him off. Bring it. Gotcha. T trap. Oh, you're alive. Enough. Get him. That was close. Here, right? No, take the lead. I'll, I'll do what I can. Oh. Get him. Call the fire. Oh. 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 oh, Aerith is by herself. Disappearing deer. Terrifying. Oh. Looks like they're all slightly different colors. Let's see. Well, one of these auto-matched Torkin's picture. 
Okay. Now. Oh, it's this one then. Yeah, the triangles. Yeah. I'd say that's the one we want. Wait, do we want all three? What was the point of this? Unless there's more over here? Ah. Right? Gotcha. Yeah. Yep, nailed it. Where are the others? There's nothing else here though. I must be blind because I really don't see anything else. Is it up? Is it up here? Where's the others? On second thought. What the hell? Ah, there it is. The dog could have brought me here. What a gorgeous color. Almost feels like a waste to grind him up. All right. I think we've got plenty of salt now. Next up are the Magunga mushrooms. Torkin said we'll need a chocobo to sniff them out. Where the hell's Baggin Hill? Oh, we could stop by here. That's Baggin Hill. Got it. All right, since we're here, might as well stop by. I hope to finish this within the hour so we could go to Nibelheim. He's all smithery. In fact, this could be a whole new string to the Shinra Resort's goal, eh? The rural getaway! 
Cast off modernity to embrace eternity. You'd be surprised how many people would go for it. It could be a nice little error. Uh, not making any progress at all. What's wrong with you? Why would you try that? Thank you. Give me more, give me more. The hell with it. Back to square one. Huh? Who are you? Whatever, I don't have time to... <sighs> that arm. That magnificent arm. Uh. It is a weapon. But how does it work? A universal adapter, allowing you to switch out weapons at will. But look at all these scratches. Wait, have you been going around punching things with your attachments? <laughs> uh, occasionally. Doing so ought to have given you multiple bone fractures. But this unique cylinder provides unparalleled shock absorption, allowing for high impact performance. Who was the genius that built this? An old friend, I guess. Don't know where he's at now, though. Uh, wait right there! <laughs> Eureka! The... <laughs> Sorry, got carried away. My name's Izo. I've been trying to create the ultimate weapon. Ooh. My attempts have all failed miserably. But thanks to you, I finally made a breakthrough. I must harness the inspiration while I can. Please, help me build it. Gather the materials I need. You live here? I'm originally from Junon, but I could hardly breathe there. So I decided to leave it all behind. I wandered in search of somewhere I could build my weapons in peace. And eventually, I wound up here. Not a bad place, huh? Of course, materials can be hard to come by when you live out here in the sticks. Though it seems crude at a glance, look close. The craftsmanship is remarkable. Whoever made it must have been a specialist in a completely different field. No mere weaponsmith would have been half as clever. Indeed, I've made it my life's work. Frustrating though it's been. How to conceive a weapon I lack the vocabulary to describe. Well, if all you need is some material, sure, why not? Just leave it to us. Wonderful, thank you. I believe I left a map in my storage shed that you can use to find what I need. Oh god, another map. Grab that before you head out, and you shouldn't have any trouble. Don't forget about that materials map I left in my storage shed. If you want to help me out, you'll need to know where to look. Why do I have to use the map? Wait a second, how do you get up there anyway? Look at the layout. Barrett, get out of my way. You see, the steps are over here. And you're that guy. You block it here. Yeah, how do you get over here? Huh. You don't want me to steal your treasure, huh? Say, Smart. Never seen someone so interested in my arm. Most folks try their best to look the other way. He's a weird one. Huh. That's putting it mildly. Made me realize, too, how soft I've gotten. Because in the old days, I would have said no touching and dashed his ass. In the old days? If it ain't the present, it's the past, son. Where's the storage set? Ah, it's over here. Nope. Am I stupid or something? Didn't he st say get the map from the storage shed? 
Oh, it's over here. I didn't realize this is a separate... Oh, okay. I didn't realize it. I thought the shed would be just very close to his building, but no, it's... I mean, it's not, like, it's not very far away, but still much farther than I thought. Stamp? Yeah, I know, I just saw it. I don't need a chocobo for this, do I? Is it this one? Wait, is he pointing out the rope? Oh, there's a rope. Is this the place we're looking for? Damn! Abilities, assess. Deal with that. Here goes. I need a Barrett for this. That'll do. Can you take over, Let me? Go on. Let's do this. Wind current. You're done. Scrub slash. Scrub slash. Wind current. It's on now. Get ready. Let's do this. Up slash. 
It's on you. So is my turn? <laughs> all out. Go on! Uh. Right. What? Why don't you leave the I got this. Come on. Star shower. You're out. My turn. <laughs> Limit. Cross slash. <laughs> Raga. Deal with that. I'll show you what I can do. Ow. Sorry, but I gotta. I am on fire today. I've been pretty rough on you, I know. But you've always come through for me. Thanks, buddy. Don't know where I You didn't even fight! You. Five. Ah. Six. Seven. Ah, eight. We did it. Hold up. Is that everything? It is. Let's head back and check in with Isa. Okay. Okay. Fast travel. about materials that map will lead you straight to where you can find my materials though but do keep an eye out for monsters excellent it's all here thanks if you're not in a rush wait here while I finish up <laughs> I get that it's your profession, but do you actually enjoy this? Making weapons? Of course I enjoy it. That's why I chose this job. Besides, it's the wielder who dictates the true value of a tool. Weapons, too. Aye, that's especially true for weapons. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh! Yes, yes! I've done it! Feast your eyes on my masterpiece! My gift to you, I insist. I may not be the gentlest owner, you know. <laughs> User as you like. The wielder dictates the value of the tool, remember? And by association, the value of the maker. Therefore, what good I put out into the world depends on who I entrust with my weapons. That's how I choose to see my part in it all. <laughs> Hell of a lot of pressure to put on some guy you just met, don't you think? The adapter that your friend made. It's a gift in more ways than you know. He was thinking of your future, of what you might do after the dust settles. Today, you may have no choice but to wield a weapon. But tomorrow, 
years from now? Think about it if you haven't. The man who fashioned your adapter is an inspiration in his own right. And that's no lie. Hmm. <laughs> Afnir rifle. Maybe one day you'll ask me to turn your arm into a giant egg beater. I'll make it so you can whip up a cake to serve a hundred. Ah. <laughs> Weird time to be joking around, man. Not joking in the least. That's the price for my masterpiece. You owe me a cake fit for a king. <laughs> so don't you go dying on me. You hear? Yeah. Hopefully we see you again in uh, part three. Talk about a weirdo. Friendly, though. True. A weirdo with the heart of gold. Nice. Is that really Barrett's ultimate weapon, though? Or is there something better than this? Ah, it's only five materia. Eh, fine. We'll do that. Cool. All right. One more to go. Must be the area Torgan was talking about. So we're gonna need a chocobo to search. Uh huh. Whoa. Right here. No way. Hold on. I don't want to screw up the first time. Okay. What are you doing? Seriously? How do I? With the most give. Oh my god, my control is going haywire. Okay. Stop it! Stop! Stop! How do I know which one has the most give? Greatest range of motion?
So you mean that, that, and then that? Oh, that's what it means. More of them ought to be around here somewhere. Okay, back to the birds. All right. Really? Oh. Oh, why'd you do that? You confused the hell out of me. Enemies! Fire, right? Oh, you gotta be shitting me. These two seem the same to me. All right, whatever. Okay, that works. Sensational picking, Mr. Merck. One more to go. Let's use the chocobos to find the last mushroom. We have to find the mushrooms! Oh, not again. Okay, then. Don't overdo it. 
You go. Watch oh crap! Monster. Hold on. Shit! Go through? Oh my god. Oh no, oh no. I don't know what to do. Eric. For you. Shit. Backline. All right. Ooh. Yes, let's do it. Let's show them real teamwork. Yes. Get ready. Get on. That's the way to do it. Fire impulse. Let's make it hot. What? Oh my god, this is really I can't even do anything. Oh no. Are you fucking kidding me? This is not good. I won't. This is really not good. Here you go. Get ready. Shit. Get him. Oh, come on. Oh my god, that is so stupid. Yeah, I should. I didn't think that I would fight the jellyfish again. I honestly didn't think so. Yeah, fuck. Oh, I got screwed over. I need a Barrett for that. And also, Cloud didn't have that much MP, honestly. Alright. We'll do that. Alright. It's on you. Yeah, yeah. I'll do it. Give them hell. I'm your one stop sovereign shop. Uh -huh. What do you like that? Huh? Alright, Ninja Two. Are you kidding me? I can only do spells. Bells. Kira. Don't overdo it. Alright! Watch and learn! 
Ah, motherfucker. No escape. You're in good hands now. How do you like this? Okay. Windstorm again. Windstorm again. Hey, keep it together. Need my help, do you? Finally. Man, those jellyfish are the hardest ones so far. The third and final. Let's not mess this up. Both seem the same. Hmm. Why not? This is the last one. All right. Has to be. What? No way. I still see the stem over here. So this is correct, but this isn't? How is this not correct? That makes no fucking sense. Oh, that's bullshit. I can't even back out of this. I'm, uh, I, I didn't even save this. Oh, man, that's so dumb. How is this not second? This is not second? I see the fucking stem. Are you fucking high? This has to be second. This shit is second. Look at that! How is it? Broken or not, it all tastes the same, right? That makes no fucking sense! I'm sorry! What the fuck?! That should be it for the mushrooms. Yep, looks like we're done done. Let's get this stuff to- Oh me. my god, fuck this shit! No, 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 no! Fuck no! We see more of the fucking stem in the uh, second one. I'm not blind, am I? The other ones, we don't see the stem. The second one, we still see part of the stem. And I looked at the bowl. I, I don't get it. W what makes you think that's fine? I don't want to try another combination because you already damaged so much health. So yeah, what the fuck? I didn't even say before this. Oh my god, Th this is so stupid. I, I don't understand here. I is it? I wonder if it's random. Like, if I check up a guide, is it gonna tell me, oh, this is the correct way, or it's uh, always gonna be random? 
because I felt like I got uh, robbed over here. And if you're wondering if uh, I could feel the vibration, the vibration feels the exact same. The sound effects still sound the same to me. It's just visually that's different. And I'm pretty sure that the second one is in the bottom right. Oh my God. Now you're probably thinking, David, uh, the game told you it's wrong. Why'd you do it again? Because I want to prove that the game is wrong. <laughs> I mean, you can't know. Then it could be anything after that. If it's if that's not the second one, then what else could it be? Obviously not the left one, but we still have the top one and the top right. Oh my God, that's infuriating. Oh, that's so stupid. That is so stupid. I'm sorry. That that is some fucking bullshit. Okay? No. I I cannot I cannot accept that. That's some fucking bullshit. That's why it's very confusing about which one gives uh gives you the most give and shit. Okay, visually. Visually number two! That should have been number two! Uh. Here, here, I'm arguing with the game. You know, they... Oh, she's using fire materia? Yeah, that leaves up. Enjoy your new home in the trash can. Am I ever gonna get this right? All right. Give her all the ingredients you have. Two stars, fuck you. We come bearing ingredients. Why don't you give it one more shot? I can pitch in too. Well, since you guys went to the trouble. Okay, one more shot. Uh, wait, no! Oops. Whatever. This might turn out okay. <laughs> Told you. The fairs are always inviting me over for dinner. Thought I'd be nice and return the favor by making them poison, apparently. But as you can see, I'm a sore loser. Cooking's never as easy as you think. Got that right. Didn't need to learn back in Midgar. The company provided all our meals. Tasted like garbage, though. Don't know how I stomach the stuff. That bad, huh? <laughs> but what about the bombberry flavor? <laughs> bombberry? What, like the military rations? Yeah, those. Uh, sorry, that's really not important. Uh, what is important is the soup. The soup! Time to taste test! <sighs> Whoa there, might want to let it cool. Right. Oops. That's pretty good. You can really taste the Gangaga mushrooms. This flavor is incredible. Great job. <laughs> I love moments like this. All right, we're done. Oh, I know. A souffle is probably not that tough. Seriously? As for what next, Maybe something easier. So you want to do a souffle? I'd burn down my kitchen if not for you. Thanks. As for what next, maybe something easier. All right, we finally did it. It's over. Let's go to Nibelheim. Finally, we're done with the open world stuff so far. Oh boy. I can't believe there's one more freaking Moogle house. I'm gonna fucking rage. Y'all need a lift? This is it! Nibelheim!
stars fell from my eyes. Chapter 11, The Long Shadow of Shinra. Black materia. like they swung by Cosmo Canyon just so they could lead us here. Sorry, just thinking out loud. Forget about it. All right. Odin! I can't call it Chocobo. Do I have to wrangle one? I don't want How big is this area? Damn, this place is huge. Aha! I don't have a chocobo on me. Oh. I see. Seriously, where are the Chocobo parents? Like, um, it's supposed to fend for itself and it automatically knows to help uh, strangers find a Choco stop? I mean, how does this work? I just realized this. I didn't even think about it before. Now it just came to me. Where is his parents? Is this, a uh, like, um, you know, a tradition? <laughs> like, no matter what. Listen, son, when you grow up, you gotta uh, help us uh, strangers find Choco stops. For some reason, the signs keep getting knocked down. What? Who said that? Wah! Getting a lot of Phoenix downs, but uh, hopefully I can find some new items. You know, like Giga Phoenix down or something like that. No music. Kate, I meant to tell you before, but the terminal's probably gone. Nibelheim burned down five years ago. The terminal is as snug as a bug in a rug. Kashinra wasn't about to let that facility burn down. Meaning the reactor? Well, that's important too, but no. I'm no expert on Nibelheim, but what I do know is that it's the only lead we have on that materia. So, not much choice. Yeah. It's this or nothing. We should get going. Oh. I got in my face now, tower. Let's fight. Ow, ow, ow. Take the lead. Yes, Allow me. Fire. Stay down, asshole! 
Stardust Ray. I need a new sword for Cloud, and I gotta find a chocobo. Wait a second. Oh, gotta find a chocobo. <laughs> ah, crap. One moment. And we're back. Alright, assess. You have to I got you. Know. Ice. It's on you. I'm coming. That'll do. I think we're almost done. One more shot. Right. I got Never in doubt. Okay. Hold on a second. Ooh. Oh, it's above? What the fuck? What is this shit? Oh no. Selena? How the fuck am I supposed to do this?
All right, I got five of them. Six. Seven. Eight. Can I throw it that far? Seriously? Why is he aiming horrible? Seriously? Wait, how do I direct the aiming? Because it seems broken right now. Why is it so far? Wait a second, was I supposed to do it from up there? I'm a little confused. You gotta be kidding. How does this work? Are you fucking kidding me with this? How the hell am I supposed to... This mechanic makes no sense. It seems broken. you tell me this earlier oh my god are you kidding Are you kidding? Any hey. game checkpoint, okay. Okay. 
No, 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 you are. Okay. Oh. I didn't realize how slow uh, the chocobo is. Oh my god, this is gonna be super annoying. Gotta figure out the timing. Go, go, go. Shit. Don't touch it. Okay. Ah. Uh. Oh my god, I have the worst patience for this. How does the timing for this go? Uh-huh. Yeah, let's wait. Good, it didn't touch it. Get out of there. That's good enough, right? All right. That's good enough, right? That better be good enough. I'm going to be pissed. There we go. Good bird. Oh, we did it. No way. No way.
What the? Oh, that's cool. Whoa. Oh, that's cool. That is really cool. <laughs> Wait, so how does this one work? go even higher? Doesn't seem like it. Oh! Cool! Nice! Oh, shit! Oh, you! Why are you fighting? Why are you hurting me so? All right, assess. Nice. Abilities. Nope. Yeah, cheat trap. Shower. Take the lead. Go slash. Now's our chance. Right. You can do it. I can still help. Stay strong, okay? Bring it. Energy. Blizzard. Blizzara! Couldn't have gone any better. Pull back. There we go. I think we grabbed the chocobo. For that, yeah. 
There we go. I don't know what these are for, but... This is fun. There we go. Man, explore- Wow! Seriously, how are you doing this? This is cool. Is this not... Ah! Thank you. Nice. Let's fight this thing. I'm ready for you. Fallon. Set. Oh, what's happening to Aerith? Okay. Lazara. My turn. It's on now. Going in. Infinity's end. Don't stop now. Team, time to end this. Star shower. You're up. Take it over. Keep it together. I'll show you what I can do. Yeah. Get him. Someone looks kind of shaky. One more shot. Pray. Why don't you lead the way? Okay. okay. Go on. Synergy. Might as well. Copy. No time to celebrate. Beautiful. Seriously, this is fun. Exploration is awesome. What's over here anyway? Up in here? Ooh. Huh. Seriously? After all that, nothing? Oh, come on. Ugh. Why can't things just work? Just work. That's all I want. That's all anyone wants. Just work it. I wonder if this is some kind of currency. These choco grass. Because I'm getting a bunch of them. Or it's probably going to be used for... Item transportations. Do these respawn? Are there a limited amount? I wonder. There we go. Oh, there's a crystal thing here. Okay, might as well. Even though I did say I want to do, uh, you know, main story for now. This is so much fun. <laughs> there we go. Let's 
Slumbering within the evil sanctuaries is Odin, the patron knight of war and death. He rides in from the land of the dead, astride his steed to sleep here, claiming the souls of fallen warriors as his own. Or so the stories say. Well. There you go. Now fighting you guys. Nothing over here, right? Cool. Yep, don't mind us. Yes. I'm surprised Odin is um, a summon after Bahamut. It's like Pop Fantasy 16 all over again. X circle square triangle, X circle square triangle. Okay, fine. Ah, crap, I forgot. X circle square triangle. There we go. Analysis complete. I managed to extract the necessary data from the crystal. This should allow me to strengthen your materia. What the hell? Am I stuck? Well, there we go. There's a rest stop here. There you go, buddy. Damn it. There we go. What the? Uh huh. That zoo. I don't know how to get inside it, so I gotta come back next time. Let's 
Looks like I've been here, right? Nope. I have not. Seriously, why are these uh, floating around? At least we grab all these choco stops. Is that another one? That is another one. There we go. Where's the little chocobo here? There he is. What's this? Oh. Moonstone. <laughs> this is just hilarious. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I'm not gonna fight crickets. That another tower right there? Yes, it is. Windstorm. Windstorm. Focus trust. Gotcha. Uh, Just like that, okay? There we go.
Oh, it's right here, right? Yep. Oh, cool. Yeah. Where do we have to go? Oh, all the way over there. Gotcha. Theater. Oh, hells yeah. We're in monster territory now. Rare I don't want to fight them. Variant detected. Commencing guidance protocol. It is thought that the audience. I'm not buying them. Not worth it. What the hell? I can't use this yet? All right. Oh, that's probably, probably, uh, are the proto relic shit? All right. All right. Time to go. Didn't expect to be. Oh, it's right here. Nope, that's the spirit thing. Hello. Look at little sage's manner. Huh. Huh? Cloud? What? Billy? What are you doing out here? Um, I haven't had much luck at the racetrack lately. Not the good kind, that's for sure. So I came here to train. Train? Here? You don't know where you are? This is the home of THE Chocobo Sage! A living legend! Surely you've heard of the man! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Did someone say living legend? <coughs> you okay, sir? <coughs> I am now. Thought I was a goner. Huh? 
mind telling me who you are? I don't get many visitors out here in the boonies. Uh, this is Cloud. He's a jockey for Gramps' ranch. Oh, he is, huh? Perfect. Billy here needs some help. You can pick up the poor boy's slack. There's this big race at the saucer, the Gold Cup, and it's coming up soon. We gotta get in on that, so I came here to bone up. I'm learning all sorts of stuff. See? Hey, tell me you're not buying this choco dung. Picking garbage out of a pool isn't training, it's manual labor. You Have you not too, seen the right? Karate Kid, man? <laughs> this, this age is the real deal. What? If anyone was gonna get it, figures it'd be you. This man right here wrote the book on chocobo rearing. In fact, pretty much all the major breeds maintained these days are products of his techniques. If you can flap your gums, you can move your gams. Now get on back to your training. Sorry. As for you, I know just the thing. One of my chocobos ran off when we put her out to pasture. Need you to find her. Bring her back. You're asking me? Her name is Selena. Ain't what? a normal chocobo neither. Huh. the ocean more than Well, home. I already did it. <laughs> the way she makes rolling waves look like solid ground. No wonder she thinks she's the bee's knees. Please, Cloud, would you mind? Just think of it as a favor for me. I already did You've it. got a gift for wrangling the wild ones. A bird that runs on water? I already found him. There you are, Selena. Well, I underestimated you. Takes real skill to tame this girl. Skills like those of... Hold on. I know this. I do. Why can't I remember? Oh, damn it! This is gonna bother me all day. Oh. Aha! There we go. It was Sam and Will. What? They were far and away my best disciples. As I was saying, you, Cloud, you may well become as talented a trainer as them one day. <laughs> Did I hear you right? Sam, you gotta tell me everything you know about him. You're gonna give me whiplash, son. <sighs> the Sam guy you taught. You mean Chocobo Sam out of Midgar? I do, but why do you want to know? Because me and him, we got history. You see, I'm Will's son. Well, don't that beat all. I'll never forget those two. They had such a powerful passion and an eagerness to learn, too. Everything they did was for the birds. That's not the Sam I know. Sam's a demon. He led my parents to an early grave. Got them hooked on gambling. Pushed them to rack up tons of debt. And then... Yeah, that don't sound like him to me. You sure you ain't got your Sams mixed up? It's a common name, you know. <laughs> Only one Sam in this business. I swore that I'd humiliate him by winning the Gulp Cup. Destroy his reputation. Then I'd at least have some kind of revenge for what that bastard did to my parents. Hmm. Now that that's out of your system, back to it. Excuse me? You heard me. Thought you came out here to learn about chocobos, not to get revenge. Uh... Cloud, for your next task, I'll need you to take Selena and gather choco grass, which uh -huh. has to grow above bodies of water. You kidding me? This fossil's trying to get us to do his dirty work again? <laughs> Choco grass is a genuine panacea. I kid you not. It'll cure whatever ails you, and then some. And once I am cured, maybe I'll be inclined to share more stories about the good old days. <sighs> He's obviously full of it. If not for him, then please do it for me. I need to know what happened to my dad. How many do you need? <sighs> okay. When I said it grows above water, I meant above. It's called the floating flower, because it grows in the air. 
But with an ocean chocobo, you can harvest the stuff with ease. 30 tufts all to do. Oh shit. Just hop to it, Cloud. You don't want my death on your hands, do you? How many do I have? <laughs> I can't believe my dad and uncle trained here back in the day. Oh, 26 out of 30? Are you kidding? Wait. Do I have enough? Oh, I don't have enough. Four more. Alright, I think I could do that. What oh, do you got? Loud. Have you come to brush up on your bird handling? As soon as I heard the legendary Chocobo Sage was here, I knew I had to come. I was surprised to see a recluse residing in such luxury. Even hermits enjoy a dip in the pool. Oh, hell yeah. Wait. Hope oh, these are good. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, these are all good. I wish you all the best in your ongoing hunt for world intel. All right. Need all of these, honestly. You know what? Give it to Aerith. Comment. Level boost. Are you here to learn from the sage as well? What you got? Mm hmm. All right. I know the sage is a bit of a handful, but stick with it, okay? It'll oh. all pay off in the end. I promise. Hey, since you seem to be in the know, give me the skin. Who's that Sam guy? Big shot in Walmart. Uh huh. They must be pretty stunning. I don't know. The male business aside, it didn't strike me as a total asshole. Interesting. Well, maybe your powers of perception weren't honed enough to see through his facade. That's oh, got oh, it. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. oh, if only I had found you sooner. I could have saved you from your own gullibility. Eagleheim's not far now. First time back since. Yep. Yeah. Still. There we go. Didn't seem worth coming back till now. Didn't think there was anything to come back to. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. Lots happened since then. Uh, Cloud, stay close, would you? <laughs> oh, no. It's just... All right, gotta get it over with. This stupid thing. Final one, right? 
I'm gonna rage so, so much. I'm really dreading this. Oh, I didn't even save for a while. Let's try easy. It says intel will be gathered no matter what. Would you mind rounding up all the Mooglets for me? There we go. Last one, right? We go. Thanks so much. That was the first try. You're a true hero. Every single emporium is once again open for business, Kubo. It was Mog and Mag's hope that these special shops would bring happiness to folks all throughout the world, Kubo. And that dream lived on, passed down to their children and their children's children, and so on, for countless generations. One day, these Mooglets will inherit that legacy, like those before them. Oh, before I forget, I have a super duper amazing present for you, to thank you for all your help. You're gonna love it. Oh my god, no. Cloud is a boogle. Oh my god. Koopo. <laughs> Be good hosts and show our guest how it's done. <laughs> Oh 
Oh my god, what's gonna happen now? Oh my god. Now that we've been reunited, the Mooglets and I will continue our efforts to spread joy all over the world. Also, we found a bunch of rare and exotic items you won't want to miss out on. Come see for yourself, Koopo! Over here! Okay! Please shop to your heart's content, Koopo! All righty. There we go. I have 60 of you, huh? All righty. No. We're done. <laughs> oh my god, we did it. We actually did it. On our first try, too. That was beautiful. Alrighty. You know what? Let's go back here. Chocobo. Wait, nope, nope. Wrong one. There we go. You get your hands on that choco grass. Why does it seem like weed? <laughs> well, well, if it ain't my beloved choco grass. This stuff can be one hell of a hassle to gather. Thank goodness I had you to get it for me. Okay, so what are you going to do with it? We're going to smoke it. <laughs> I suppose you've earned the right to know. First, I take this fluff. Mix it with some chocobo feathers and let it ferment. Once it's dry, I boil it all down. Then I squeeze it all out and voila, my patented choco tincture. That's some kind of magic medicine? Oh no, just a little fun. <laughs> Cheeky old. Speaking of grass, if you've got some extra tufts on hand, would you mind sharing them with my assistant at the shop? I promise I'll make it worth your while. Please, tell me about my father. Hold your chocobo, son. There's still one thing you need to do for me first. What a surprise. This geezer isn't gonna tell you Jack. Face it, kid. You got a lot of nerve. Casting aspersions. After all the wisdom I've shared. All the what now? <laughs> so you haven't realized you've been training this whole time? Tracking down Selena forced you to get in touch with a chocobo's feelings. And all that running across the water you did helped hone your sense of balance and your bird handling. Key skills for any aspiring jockey. What do you say, Cloud? Bet you feel like a real choco pro by now. Can't say I do. Sounds to me like you need more training. Reckon we ought to add one more item to your regimen. Think of it as a final trial of sorts. Oh, give me a break. Don't go changing the subject here, Gramps. We're not doing your stupid trial. No, it's fine. I'll do it. Then it's settled. I'll be your opponent. What? And dear Selena will be your steed. If Cloud wins, 
Does that mean you'll finally tell me about my dad? You've got a deal. But know that I won't be pulling any punches out there. When you're ready, give me a holler and we can hit the track. Huh. Hold on a second. You got any choco grass for me? Now how about plumes? Choco grass for what? Oh, I see, I see. Otherworldly crystal, Gallahorn cleansing material. Gallahorn, huh? Okay. Good luck out there. You prepared to undertake the final trial? Might as well. Undertake Zoom the Chocobo. I totally forgot how this works. I honestly totally forgot how it works. Damn it, damn it, ah. Try it again. I didn't do any chocobo races for a while. Asshole. Come on! Shit. Oh, come on! What a fucking douche. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, Jesus Christ.
Ah, uh, he's ahead of me. Retry. Did he get there fast? Oh, come the fuck on. Drifting is really terrible here. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. There we go. Woo. We did it. Plucked by ever loving feathers. That was one hell of a performance. If I didn't know better, I'd say this wasn't your first rodeo. Surprise. Well, shoot. <laughs> you got me good. And once you start tearing up the track out there, the racing world will blame me for letting you loose. A promise is a promise, sir. Please tell me more about my dad and Uncle Sam. Hmm. All right, then. What do you want to know? Let's see. They couldn't have been much older than you are now. The two of them came and asked me to take them under my wing. Turned them down, seeing as I'd already retired. But they hung around the grounds anyway. Since they had nothing better to do, I put them to work. And that's how it all began. Well, wasn't nothing out of the ordinary, I'd say. Ran some errands, did some repairs, helped around the house. You know, your standard training regimen. And in their downtime, they took it upon themselves to dig through my library, learning about chocobos and how to handle them came to differing conclusions. They used to argue something fierce. I can't say the two of them got on terribly well. I figured. Will and Sam had mighty strong opinions about how to best raise chocobos, and it drove them to fight with their words and with their fists. That said, only reason those two fought as hard as they did is because they both cared deeply about the cause. As far as passion is concerned, the two of them were birds of a feather. Hmm. How you feel now? Managed to sort out the mess inside? Uh, uh, what do you mean? When we first met, I saw the way your eyes were brimming with anger. I knew right then and there that what you needed wasn't teaching or training. What you needed was time. 
time to look deep inside yourself and clear out all the wickedness and spite that have been haunting your heart. Which is why you had him clean out the pool? <laughs> exactly. I don't know what happened to your father after he left this place. And I can understand why you'd want to beat old Sam in a race. Few things feel better than sticking it to someone who did you wrong. But that being said, you should never use your birds as tools for revenge. Ask yourself, why did I decide to start raising chocobos? I guess... I guess it's because I saw how happy those birds made my mom and dad. How they'd smile. The chocobos brought us a lot of fun, and brought us together as a family. I guess that's why. Good enough. The why is important, so don't forget yours. I reckon Sam's got his eyes on the gold cup. Keep yours unclouded by hatred, and you'll do fine. Thank you, sir. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna head back to the saucer. Make sure our birds are ready for the big race. Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll take care of it. All you need to do is show up and win. All right. Cool. No losing to anyone else, you hear? Can't have you dragging my good name through the mud. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna head back to the saucer. Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll... Alrighty. We did it. Alright, let's go back here. Thank you. Life spring is around here, huh? another tower oh it looks like I already did that one where are the others oh do I have to do the story mode and then come back to it ah Show me, little chocobo.
There we go. Thank you. said this yeah come on cool item transportation what do I got do an X potion now. Aha, uh -huh. there's a cave over here. There we go. What's over here? I see. No, no, no. What are you doing? Just get down. Oh, it's automatic, I think. Once I press L2, it's going to keep doing that. At least now I know how to get there. Okay. I thought that was uh, some other secret area. That poor fiend. I don't care about the fiend. he got us lost because it looks different so who do you think we built it shinra never mind all that we've got a terminal to find
Fast travel is unavailable. You got we allow our patients to walk around for their health and well-being. Slow and steady. I'm not a tired. Any treasures? I hear they're planning on building a new facility. Where's the people keep wandering people? So those creepy. Yeah, there's no need to rush. No, I came up around here way back in the day. It's strange. None of the buildings look like that. Well, shit. A lot of ropes out here. Yeah. And look. Locals. Aren't quite the same, are they? Hello there. Can I help you? Greetings, good sir. I am a proud employee of Shinra Resorts. And since I was nearby, I thought I might pop in and check something on the company database. And your companions? Oh, them? They are. I used to live here until. You know. I see. And are you aware of what Nibelheim is now? Nope. No idea. Uh, five years ago, Shinra assumed direct control over this village. It now serves as a treatment center for Mako poisoning. All property rights have been transferred. If that's why you're here, contact Special Facilities at Corporate. They'll be able to help you. Very helpful. Thank you, sir. Ah, but the database. I'll not be a wee minute. Uh, uh, uh. I'm sure you're eager to see your hometown, but please, don't stay too long. Queen's blood here, this, you know. Queen's blood that. Question, this always been here? Yeah. It totally screams, climb me, doesn't it? So, let's give the poor thing what it wants and see the sights. <laughs> hey, don't just... This place, you'd never know. Yeah. <laughs> so, which one's your house? That one. Oh, looks cozy. Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. No, don't worry about it. It's all new to you. That building right there is the inn. Where I stayed five years ago. You got the town hall. The general store. In that there? Tifa's house. <laughs> so let me guess. This is where you kept lookout. Huh? Come on, you never came up here hoping she'd wave?
Sounds like something I do. Probably. Sounds like something I do. If I was in your shoes, I would have been up here all the time. I'm gonna head down. Think I'm good where I am. I'll see you later. If you don't mind, I'd like to be alone. Are you angry? Mm -hmm. Oh. What? At me? Not at you. At everything. Must be nice. To have a friend you've known since you were a kid. Someone you can say, remember the time when? To someone you can reminisce with. I don't have anyone like that, and it feels like I'm being taunted for it, which stings more than it should. That is why I want to be alone. Plus, I might take it out on you, and I don't want that. Aww. I don't mind. Well, I do, and it'd only make me feel worse. Thank you, though. Really. I'll be down in a bit. See you then. Fresh air. Peace and quiet. Not a bad place to grow up. I know it's not the village you knew, but it's still nice. Fresh air, peace and quiet. Not a bad place to grow up. Was that red? Something about that place doesn't sit right with me. You mean Shinra Manor? Oh, sorry. No one wants to hear people badmouth their hometown. I never liked that place either. Hey, I'm with you. Never liked that place. Just looking at it gives me the creeps. Hopefully the company's not using it anymore. Come to think of it, it's kind of rude we keep calling them robed guys and stuff. They've got names, right? I keep asking myself, what could Shinra want with all these robed guys? Wait. Uh, come to think of it. Yeah, it's that's weird. Rude Why? We keep calling them robed guys and stuff. They've got names, right? Looks like the reactor's not too far. Hey, Cloud, ever been up there before? Yeah. Oh, then give me the skinny. What was it like? Was there buttloads of Mako? What about, say, oh, Materia? Come to think of it, nope. Come to think of it, nope. Uh-huh, nice try. But you can't fool me. I know what you're up to. You want it all for yourself. All right, everybody. <laughs> what are we waiting for? That Materia needs me. Ready to get started? What are we waiting for? The materia needs me. Okay. At least she's blue. So. Oh, what a pleasant surprise. Say, why don't you and those robed folks pose for a photo? What kind of pose is that? It turns out that Shinra's in charge of the treatment facilities here. Getting permission to take pictures was not easy. All my photos would be reviewed, and if Shinra sees something they don't like, it's theirs. Just gotta impress those suits with some nice shots. If you find a good photo spot, don't hesitate to let me know. So that's Mount Nebel. It cuts a rather stark. Right? An imposing figure. Yes. Hey there! Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. Great work getting that shot. You really are one shrewd shutterbug. To quote the association, your talents are inimitable. You've got quite the portfolio now. Can't wait to see how it grows. I'm a Vogue photographer. Some martial artist and Zondon came up with the sex That's what everyone tells me. <laughs> 
I understand this is just relax. You're all right. The kitties aren't here. Oh my god, they probably died in the fire. So that's Mountain Eagle. Slowly now. Breathe in. I keep asking who. It's okay. Take all the time you need, all right? Where are the other guys? This town is under the jurisdiction of Shinra. You're an odd one to come out to the middle. Wait a second. Who's in my party again? Hey, Sith is away. So I talked to Yuffie. I talked to Aerith. I talked to Red 13. Hey, Sith is away. Didn't talk to Tifa or Barrett yet. Okay. Yeah, I have to double check. Who am I missing? Where's uh, Barrett? Keepa's at her house. There's nothing here, you know. Where's the shop? I feel so bad for these people. I can only think they deserve this. So that's Mount Me. I know. <laughs> Barrett's not here, huh? Fine. If you're that desperate to buy something. Why are you giving me such a mood? <laughs> Alright. There we go. Oh. I see. This isn't your home anymore. Remember that, all right? Why would you say that to me? Another so rude. Hope I, can... I know. All right. I... Oh, I I think I'm fine with the Celestial uh, Bangle. I'll keep that. Yeah, I think that's better. that grab that okay we'll figure out the material later Hey, Barrett. They're everywhere you look. You don't really think that all these guys decided to get up and shuffle over here of their own accord, do you? Of course not. This is Shinra's doing. First, they raise a whole village because it suits them. Then they build a fake one right on top of it. We can't let those corporate bastards keep getting away with this shit. We gotta do something, right? Hell yeah, screw them. Hell yeah, you're right. Screw them. That's the spirit. Screw them. We'll make them pay for what they did to y'all's home. <laughs> These boys are lucky they got us looking out for them. If Shinner tries anything, I'll make sure they don't succeed. <gasps> Listen, Cloud. I don't know what went down five years ago, but I'm here for you and Tifa. Whatever you need. If it's too much, just say the word. We'll leave. Thanks, Barrett. These boys are lucky they got us looking out for them. 
If Shinra tries anything, I'll make sure they don't succeed. Welcome. Would you like a room? No. Not yet. Just relax. I know. Where's uh, Tifa, though? They can't survive without us looking after them, but. Hey, I get it. Like, why even bother, right? Let's take a little break. Well, now, who might you be? Ah, uh, that's right. You're the ones Nick was talking about. New in town, aren't you? No. Uh, in that case, you ought to know better than to interrupt a busy chef, hmm? I can leave. No, no, I don't mind. Could use someone to talk to anyway. Then again, I sense you're not much of a chatterbox. La, 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 la. My cookies like no other. <laughs> Thanks to my dear old mother, God rest her soul. They say I'm always gossiping. No secrets safe with me unless I sing. Bloody blow, blow, bloody blow. <laughs> To spill the tea. Encore. <laughs> right. Let's take a little break and try again. All right. Tifa. No need to wear yourself out. Wait, that's all the houses then, right? Why don't we take a shot? All right. Ah, this is Tifa's place. You certainly don't look ill. Treatment Center. Through, I take it. If you are feeling unwell, though, you'll have. We need to take. Don't worry. It'll all be over soon. There. All done. Take care. Oh. Oh, I could play against you. Nope. Reunion. Hey, Tifa. You know. Hmm? I never understood it. Why'd my dad go into the reactor? Why chase Sephiroth? thought about it ever since waking up in Corel. It just seemed like such a bad idea. I mean, what did he think he was gonna do? Fight a famous war hero and win? Well, he didn't. But after moving to Midgar, after making a life for myself, I finally realized where my dad was coming from. He was angry. And he'd had enough. Everything he'd worked so hard for had been destroyed in an instant. All that he'd built for himself, for us, gone. Sephiroth had burned it to the ground. That's why he went, even though he had to have known how it'd end. I see. And like him, I took my pain, my grief, everything I was feeling. I took it all and turned it into anger. Anger that led me to avalanche. <laughs> the problem is, anger doesn't last. So when Avalanche started to become more violent, there wasn't enough left to hold back the fear and the doubt. It was taking a toll. Then you turned up. Like it was fate. Like it was fate. <laughs> yeah, like it was fate. A lot's happened, but now that we're here, I know this was the right decision. Because now I know they rebuilt everything. Tried to sweep what they did under the rug and pretend it never even happened. But I won't let them. I can't. 
Sephiroth and his cruelty, Shinra and their lies. I'm sick of all of it. Hey, remember when we were kids? How you'd, you know, always be looking at me? I, uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> Every time we made eye contact, you'd look away. And when I tried to talk to you, you'd ignore me. Not surprised. I was a pain in the ass as a kid. I was the opposite. I needed everyone to like me all the time. Part of me still does, I think. Kinda hate that about myself. Gotta get it together. Gotta get it together. That's it? Gotta get it together. Oh, is there a musical sheet here? No? Nope. No musical sheet. We're done. Wait. Ruby Red? Emerald C? Oh, it's talking about the weapons! Ruby Red, do you see the silhouette over here? Oh, that's cool. Oh my god, that is so clever. Ah, nope, not another weapon. Okay. I'm not sure why that is myself. Maybe it's Alright, now let's go back. This is where we care for the patients. By checkups, treatment, gotta lend the medical team a hand today. Alright. You're dying to hear about mine. Am I right? <laughs> what? Not interested? <laughs> I'm gonna tell you anyway. She's real pretty. No, beautiful. Kind of depends on the angle. What? <laughs> She's just great to be around. She from Midgard? Yep, real city mouse. Oh shit! From Gungaga. Head over heels for Eric. We fought together as soldiers. He you remembers. He that remembers way too early! You came with me on the mission. Holy crap, he actually remembers at this point? Yeah, I know that it's uh, changed, but man, I didn't expect that. I thought he was going to remember, you know, way after in disc two. <laughs> oh, man. Whoa, wait. Can I, can I talk to Bear with this here? If it's too much, just okay. say the word. We'll leave. There, there. Just relax. I can't believe the this! The services we provide oh. are strictly for the benefit of our residents. Hey, man. I should have known it was too good to be true. I only have limited access from this console. Let me guess. Limited doesn't cut it. Nope. But all is not lost. Excuse me, good sir. Would you be so kind as to grant us entry into Shinra Manor? Don't you have clearance for that? Oh, if only. I'm but a wee bottom feeder. Barely have clearance to use the bathroom, me. Be that as it may, I can't let you in there myself. You'll have to ask my boss instead. 
Meaning the Deputy Commissioner? Or the Commission himself? Let's meet and greet. Deputy Commissioner Murasaki is up at the reactor, conducting an inspection for corporate. He's due back the day after tomorrow, but he hasn't been in touch to confirm. Could be he needs more time. Uh, we can't afford to dilly-dally. Then we'll just have to track him down. Agreed. Thanks for all the help, pal. And he's fast. Alright. The whole gang is over here. So what I'm gonna do... We're gonna stop. <laughs> Alright. Everyone's happy. Everyone's blue. Alright. We're done for today. Thanks so much for watching, guys. See you next time.